Hi, my name is Sydney Nicole Barkley. Uh, my film is called A Date with Rodan. I am the director, one of the co-directors and the producer of um, A Date with Rodan. Uh, a Date with Rodan is a film about a young girl who goes on a, a blind date, essentially, with um, someone she's never met before, obviously, and chaos kind of ensues as uh, she realizes that she and this person could not be more different from one another if they try. And they do try. <laughs> They try really hard to uh, make this date work, despite being like polar opposite in almost every way. Oof, could that guy be any more of an asshole or what? <laughs> I heard he's going to space with Bezos next year. Yeah, well, hopefully he gets abducted by an alien and rescues humankind. <laughs> what are you guys talking about? Uh, waiter stuff? <laughs> I love directing actors. I think it's it's a it's a super unique experience being an actor myself to get to like talk to them. The the way I do it, I usually like talk to them like they are the character. I feel like my directing style is like, you know the that like you ever seen cartoons like the devil and the angel like on somebody's shoulder? Sometimes I feel like I'm like the devil that's like, can you believe this guy's talking to you like that? Like I get in their head of like, you know, there's um, not to give too much away about the scene or, or, or the, the film, but um, it opens with our main character. She's running late to the date and we have her running throughout the city, running on foot. But when she gets there, she learns that her date, you know, he's got a lot of money and he has a personal driver. So where to? I don't know, just go somewhere. And I like, I pulled her aside and I was like, so you mean to tell me that you ran all the way here and he has a driver? Like, why didn't he pick you up? Like, I, I got in her mind, like I loved like getting into their psyche and like essentially like talking smack to them about, like gossiping about the other characters. And then I really had to like plant that seed in her mind to like inspire that sort of light pissed off -ness that I wanted to see out of her. So that's that's kind of how I speak to my actors, yeah. I wanted to make a film that was like easily digestible and that sort of left people feeling like, oh, is it over already? Like I, that was, you know, yeah, that, that that's my hope that that people can um, relax into this journey that these characters go on from beginning to end.